Tell me about writing Killers of the Flower Moon. What was the most challenging part of writing this script? I think uh, being true to the Osage um, and also to realize Marty's vision for it. And the, the, the vision, the main vision never changed, uh, but the uh, conception of the movie changed. And mm. so I was on it for like eight years. So Eight years? Seven, eight years. So at... I don't know, I must have done 50 drafts, you know, and, and, and the changes that Leonardo and Marty suggested about that the hero should not be the great white hope in the sense uh, that we needed to lean more into uh, what was right about what we, it was right for the um, indigenous people. You know? And did that change, obviously, um, you know, political climate, um, cultural climates have changed in the last few years, so making sure that it wasn't the great white hope. Yeah, I, I mean, I think, I think even in the very original version, which f focused on the uh, um, Tom White, who was a, a ex Texas Ranger and FBI guy, that uh, t even telling it through his eyes, in a sense, even though the movie's always about Molly and the Osage, mm -hmm. um, I, I was aware just from my own upbringing that uh, at the end we had to show the injustice of things. Mm -hmm. So it, that changed, and we really leaned into it, but. Uh, it was, it was already there of a kind, you know.